High-end business laptops hardly ever get better than the ThinkPad X1 series from Lenovo. The X1 sub-brand houses several devices, but today we are giving sole attention to the Lenovo ThinkPad X1 Yoga Gen 7. It brings quality displays and the Alder Lake P and U series, which seems fitting for a 14-inch device. The laptop is very compact, weighing only 1.38 kg and having a profile of 15.5 mm. It's entirely made of aluminum while the display up front is covered in glass. With such construction you get incredible rigidity. The lid opens easily with one hand, which isn't the case with most convertibles. The bezels are thin, except for the top one, which houses a Full HD webcam and an IR face recognition sensor. The stylus has a space inside the laptop. It works very well with the glass display, offering 4096 pressure levels of sensitivity similar to many graphic tablets. The base houses the keyboard, which has a backlight and spill resistance. It also works as a vent for cooling. Typing is great, thanks to the long key travel and clicky feedback. There is a track point with physical buttons above the touchpad. Speaking of it, the pad sports a glass cover, which improves the gliding, while the tracking and responsiveness are adequate. While the laptop is compact, it still has a decent port selection, with two Thunderbolt 4 ports, a full-sized USB 5 gigabit port, an HDMI port on the left, and a 3.5mm audio jack, another USB 5 gigabit port, and the stylus pen on the right. Also, there is an optional SIM card tray. On the front, we have two display options a Full HD Plus IPS panel and a 4K UHD Plus OLED panel. Here we have the OLED panel, which is fantastic, with comfortable viewing angles, peak brightness of 401 nits, and an infinite contrast ratio. The panel fully covers the sRGB and DCI-P3 gamuts. The display reached the best possible accuracy in the DCI-P3 gamut using a DIF65 white point. The panel is very quick, with a 3 ms response time. It also uses PWM, but only up to 105 nits. Only 2 per 100 people watching this video are subscribers. If you decide to just start following us, we'll be able to reinvest more in our laboratory thus making even more helpful videos for you. Thank you, you're awesome! With a 4K screen and a 57 watt hour battery pack, we didn't expect very good results. The laptop lasts for 7 hours and 38 minutes of web browsing or 4 hours and 46 minutes of video playback when paired with the Core i7-1270p. The laptop offers a whole Alder Lake U-series and P-series range. We tested the Core i7-1270P, which has 12 cores and 16 threads. The CPU doesn't perform as well as we thought it would, scoring similarly to a Ryzen 5 5600H from last year in 3D rendering. The Photoshop scores are great, however, keeping the tradition of Intel chips being fantastic in short loads. You get an iGPU only. However, the Iris X e Graphics G7 is a quality option for productivity and some video editing and creative work. The main reason for the lack of performance is the cooling. The setup consists of a single heat pipe and two fans. There are also several heat spreaders that cover parts of the motherboard, mainly the VRMs. The CPU spikes up its wattage temperatures and clock speeds for a few quick seconds, after which all three plummet down heavily. The comfort is decent, as the fans don't get very loud. On the other hand, the whole base and keyboard heat up, due to the thin profile and limited heat dissipation. There is no RAM upgradability, as you get up to 32GB of soldered LPDDR5 RAM memory. For storage, there is one M.2 PCIe X4 slot that works with Gen 4 SSDs. If you want to know how to access the insights of the ThinkPad X1 Yoga Gen 7, check out our teardown video, which we'll leave in the upper right corner. What Lenovo has done with the ThinkPad X1 Yoga is create a durable laptop with a lot of features and craftsmanship. However, the laptop was designed with the Alder Lake U series in mind, as the cooling doesn't seem to be capable to handle the more power-hungry P series. If you want the X1 Yoga for your next device, we advise going with a 15W CPU, which should improve comfort and even battery life. If you want to see more tests and details about the device, you can check out our in-depth review. 
The link is in the video description below.